Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Wonder Kid Watch where today we've got Mario Strykens, uh, the Belgian winger from Anderlecht. Before we get started, make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel and leave a comment down below of any players you want to see in upcoming episodes. But it is Strykens today. Uh, can play on the left or the right hand side or even down the middle if you need him to. Uh, but I'd certainly say stick him out wide because he's got a nice bit of flair, a good bit of pace and acceleration and that dribbling and first touch is always very exciting. Some nice passing and technique as well as vision. So he looks okay. Uh, already made three appearances for Adelaide's first team and he's only 16 years old. So I'm hoping this is one of these world beaters that can just develop out of nowhere. Um, Belgian, of course, uh, 16 and at Andelect, so plenty. And, and I mean versatile as well of the front few. Let's take a look at his attributes, though. We can see 100 current ability, but 159 potential is massive. Could be a fantastic player. And let's hope he manages it. Uh, starting off pretty strong, but there's only one way to find out, and that's jumping ahead and seeing how he gets on. Here we are then, 24 years old now, made 40 under-21 appearances for Belgium, under-21s, and got six goals there as well. Uh, developed slightly more on the right-hand side, but again, continue to look very good in the attacking areas. Um, very, very physically good across the board. Um, nice pace, runs with ball through centre as well, so he likes to come in off those flanks and play centrally, really. Uh, some good dribbling, first touch, still looking very strong, and that flair is always, always exciting to watch uh, a player to have that sort of ability. Let's take a look at his history. We can see he's been at Andelect the whole time. Uh, did make a loan move to Sarang in the Pro League B, where he did get a bit more game time, but has finally broke into the first team a bit more, uh, having more and more games as the seasons have progressed, uh, which is good to see. 12 goals in 91 appearances in total um, and six assists. So nothing stand out, but still not too bad at all. Competitions, I'd expect him to won a few things with Anderlecht, which it looks like he has. Uh, the Pro League, he's won. The Belgian Cup, he's got runners up in. Uh, and same as the Belgian Super Cup. So, I mean, really, he's only won the Pro League a couple of times uh, whilst contributing. We can also see seasonal best 11s for Anderlecht in the most recent years. But also can see he was a young player runner-up runner, of, runner up in Belgian Pro League B, uh, was in the Pro League B team of the year as well. So, during his loan spell at Sarang, he obviously contributed enough to really stand out um, and be of interest to those around him. So he might have... That, that's probably what kicked off his career with Andelect, getting that more and more game time as the years go on. Already made four appearances this season as well, which is nice to see. Um, so an interesting looking player still. With that, let's take a look at his ability then. 126 current ability out of the 159. So still room for improvement. And I'd like to see him get there. And hopefully more game time he gets at Andelect, the higher he can rank. Um, but... Not bad at all. An exciting looking player. Certainly one to keep an eye out for, I th I'd say anyway, uh, in your saves because he's young, sprightly, already looking very, very good. Uh, but with that, we will leave it there. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure you leave a like, subscribe to the channel. And of course, leave a comment down below of any players you want to see in upcoming episodes or in FM23. And I'll catch you in the next one.